Hello there and welcome back to my FIFA 21 Road to Glory series with Barrow. I have not been able to make a video for a while now, mainly because of the joys of parenting taking up most of my time. However, I have progressed this save through my streams, which by the way, you should definitely join me for. We now find ourselves in the Premier League and pushing for a place in Europe at the first time of asking, which is pretty awesome, I must say. However, we have pretty much got to win all of our remaining games to get there. So we'll see how it goes, but pretty unlikely. As I said before, I also stream on YouTube, so if you enjoy the content, why not think about subscribing to me as well? And like the video, hit that notification button as well so you know when I post or when I go live. I stream on Mondays, Wednesdays and Saturdays at around 8 o'clock UK time, again, children dependent. Anyway, let's get on with the action. Just a quick recap then of the league, as like I say, I haven't made a video in a while, and if you haven't been watching the streams, you will need a bit of a catch up. We're sat 8th in the league at the moment, um, we are well behind Everton, or game in hand on them, so if we win this game we'll be 5 points behind, so like I said we have to win all our remaining games pretty much, however that 7th place may still get us a European spot, we'll have to see, all depends on the uh, FA Cup results and all that good stuff, so we'll keep pushing, uh, last 5 games of the season and see how we get on. We might as well get on the game then, so we've got Man United at Old Trafford, there couldn't really be much of a bigger test. Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. My name is Derek Ray, and with me for commentary is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. I remember the good old days when we were playing in League Two, and I couldn't, rem didn't really know any of the players. But Man United are a little bit easier to know. Um, most of oh, Pio, uh, Emil Hoiberg, ex Saints player, playing for them. It's still got Fernandez. Rashford and Dembele up front. And those uh, those front four are going to really cause us some problems, I think. In terms of our team, um, yeah, we have been... There's probably some new players for you. Oreso's new, Hickey's new, so we've got new full-backs. Uh, Cardoso is one of our youth players that came through. And Litty, unfortunately, is our backup left winger, as we haven't got one at the moment. And Jones is just a legend. So with United sat in second place, us in eighth, um, I'd, I'd take a draw. We need to win, though. So I've got to obviously push and try and get this win. But um, I think United, I mean, we beat City a couple of a couple of games ago. We absolutely pumped City, actually, because they just we kept catching them on the break. But I think United are a little bit more pragmatic. But we started all right. We've managed to win the ball back there, get it out to Cardosa. Oh, he puts a nice ball in, actually, but Jones just beat into the head of there. But it's good early signs from us, and we've managed to recycle that ball. And Jones has got a bit more space. He lays it in nicely to Gribben. Gribben has a go, but it's blocked. Nice little start from us, though. Jones, yeah. Jo Jones has been absolutely amazing. I think he's almost, I think he's already on 40 goals for the season in the Premier League. Oh, don't, 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 the referee's given an advantage then. Oh, well, oh. Managed to get a free kick there, and I think they were through on goal. We got away with that one a bit. But 18 minutes in, this is United's first real chance. Uh, they've held the ball well, but it's a decent effort in. It's a good save there from Svilar. But it's a save I think I would expect him to make. Again, Pelestri's managed to get in behind. We're, we're, unfortunately, we're not blessed with pace out on our, as our wing backs. So we're not the wing backs, they're full backs now. But into Fernandez or Fernandez is. Um, uh, Derek Ray likes to say, but it's decent effort, and Silver, uh, Silvestri makes another good save. United have, in the last kind of four or five minutes, have really started to push us back. Oh, it's a good, oh, it's a good ball in. I still was going to fall to uh, Dembele then, but it didn't. Thankfully, we managed to get the header in. Back out to Kimbepe. Fernandez again. United are just toying with us at the moment. It's a lovely ball out wide. Rashford. Is he going to put an early ball in? No, he's not. He's trying to get that challenge in there, but. Oh, we're all over the place defensively. We've got to try and block this off, and we do. We block it off well. So we try and work it down the right-hand side. We've just about cleared out that little bit of pressure that United had. Oh, Jones. It's about four times he's done that in this game now. He, he scores some wonder goals, but he doesn't have to waste the ball a lot. And, oh, come on, boys. We've got to get across this. A lovely challenge, but can't quite get rid of the ball. Really backs to the wall at the moment, just trying to block off every shot. Throwing challenges in, but oh, oh, that's a bad free kick to give away. Let's see what they can do with this free kick. There's Rashford then, see if he can uh, score. Or is it Hoiberg going to take it over? Hoiberg has to go. Oh, he's hit the inside of the post and it just falls. And we managed to clear it nicely. 
Well, we're still holding on here at the moment. 37 minutes played, nil-nil. And again, Joe... No, yeah, Jones, that was again. This time they might better catch us on the break. They do. They have a decent shot and Rashford just puts it wide. Got on away with another one there and it seems like it's only a matter of time at the moment. Trying to work out. We're always trying to play it out, though. I do like that. We're uh, we don't really. It's absolutely pointless doing long ball because we're not playing a Chari anymore. Oh, go on, Griffin. Get it through there. Go on, my son. He's laid a nice board to Jones. Just a little bit too far ahead of him. That was one of our few real chances we've managed to craft in this first half. So we've pretty much weathered the storm. Coming up to the uh, 45 minutes played, and we just need to try and keep them out. Was it to one minute of added time? Can we stop? Oh, no, they're through, and he's put it. Oh, God. Just as I was getting ready for that half-time team talk, Dembele scored. It was an easy goal in the end, but it was one of those ones that's very difficult to defend against because it's kind of a blindside run. But that's it. United are 1-0 up, and I think we're about to go into the uh, into the half-time break. 1-0 down. Just so disappointing. But that's it. That's uh, the referee at any minute now is going to blow his whistle. There we go. It is half time and we're going to have to turn this around in the second half. So no changes for the second half then for either team. But um, we need to probably just change the way we're doing things here because uh, United pretty much dominated us in that first half come on boys we just need to get out of this ball but United are playing a little bit more counter attacking now actually they're letting us have the ball a little bit more and oh they've worked it well we've just got to try and close him down can we get across and Debele has a shot what a goal he's put that into the top left hand corner and absolutely nothing we could do about that one apart from defend it maybe Uh, even though we're sat in uh, eighth place, there's a massive gap between us and the uh, the better teams. Even though we managed to get a good result against City, it's uh, I think that was a, definitely a one-off. Boys, come on. We need to start creating some kind of um, pressure against this team. We are working the ball a little bit better, letting it, getting out to a Litty. Now he can deliver a ball. He's not quick, but he delivers a nice ball in there, and we've managed to win a corner. And can we actually make something out of this corner? We've put a nice ball in there, looking for that header. And it's gone straight back out to the uh, the taker, and it's gone back out to Inlitti. Inlitti lays it inside to Clifford. Clifford has a go. He's got us a great turn. He puts it in that bottom right-hand corner, and we are back in this game. Okay, I completely got rid of the celebration, all that good stuff. But it doesn't matter. We're 2-1 down still, but back in this game. Oh, and United. Can, can we get back in this game and maybe force a draw? Now we have a plethora. Lovely ball. We're playing the ball a little bit quicker as our lovely ball through there. Hardcastle's got a chance for a shot. He's trying to wiggle into room. Lays it inside to Jones. Jones has to go, but it's blocked off. But, oh, he's managed to get, get through again there. Could dink a little bit of ball back. And, oh, again, we couldn't quite get the header. Thought I, I, We've had a good couple of chances now, and... This is, I suppose, when Sucker Punch comes. Yeah, there it is. Rashford's in behind. Svilar does it's a good save, but we've got to get that second ball as well. Oh, my God, we just headed it straight back to him, to one of their players, and it's a volley, and it's another good save. 20 minutes to go, then. Can we get back in this game? We're still asking some questions, but United look very dangerous on the counter-attack. Van den Beek has another go. Another great save from Svilar. We could be 5 or 6 nil down if it wasn't for him. He's definitely been one of our best signings in the last kind of 18 months. Go on, Jones. Nice ball through to Cardoza. Now, can he, can he return the favour? He lays it back. Oh, just, just when you think we're going to craft something there, he lays a stupid pass like that. And this time, so Maximan's got him behind. Oh, we're in trouble here because he is rapid. He's going to lay it inside to Vandenbeek, who buries it in the bottom left-hand corner. That's it. Game over. 
It was a decent effort, but we were just never at the races today. Two on one, left completely exposed, and it made for a simple finish in the end. So there it is, three one. The so that's it. Well, it was a decent effort, I must say, but. See, so maybe if we can try and get another goal back. But, um, yeah, United have just been the better team. So, we're into the last minute. United's still pressing us. We, we, we are struggling to get out of our own box here. They've played really well. And we're just... Oh, thankfully, Story managed to get... Oh, just what I think he's going to... Oh, my words. Villar again stops them from getting a fourth. We've, we tackle well. We just can't pass out of defence very well today for some reason. But we've got about a minute and a half left to go. Just trying to stop them from scoring another one. If we catch them on the break on the way out of here, then fine. But I don't think we're even going to get a chance for that. Dembele just wriggling around. Managed to get hold of that ball. And now the ref should blow the whistle. That's it. We've lost 3-1 at Old Trafford. And, uh, yeah, that's a bit, of a, a bit of a kick in the face, that one. A real lack of confidence. Absolutely. Nine out of ten. So after that result, that's uh, still in eighth place. Um, it's basically between Wolves, us and Brighton, really, to see who can get that seventh spot. Um, whether or not that's going to be good enough for maybe a European spot, probably not. We might just miss out this year. But it's been a really promising uh, kind of first season back in the Premier League. Back? Never been in the Premier League before. Unfortunately, that is it for this video. Um, bit, bit of an anti-climax after a month away from making videos that I'll go up and lose that one. But it was against a tough team in United. And uh, yeah, we just I think we were probably showing up at our lack of depth and, and real kind of quality apart from a few good players. But it is what it is. Anyway, thank you very much for watching the video, investing your time in my content. Um, if you like it, as I said before, then please subscribe. I am getting closer and closer to my targets for this year. My aim was to try and hit 200, um, 200 subs by the end of this year. So we're getting there. We're getting there. We're, we're almost 150 at the time of filming. Um, if you do, if you did like it, um, then please chuck the video a like. And also have a think about joining me for those streams because it's a good good laugh. We have a lot of good good guys on there. We talk mostly football and, and a bit of rubbish as well. So I'd love to see you on there. If not, have a great weekend. Enjoy the Euros and I will see you all next time.